If you love Baltimore sports, you'll love WNST.net. I actually have a friend who works in the NBA, and I asked him before he went, I said, Adam, how long have you guys been over there? Because well, they've been over there with the game of the week since the mid-'80s. So that was something that they developed, and we talked about this a bunch, of not a top-down approach, but just getting it there, having people watch it, and then, and then people all start playing basketball. We saw, we drove by a place on, on the way to uh, Wuxi or one of, one of the cities, and we couldn't believe how many basketball courts were lined up in a row. So that isn't something that happened overnight. Yao Ming was a product of the, something later on. Basketball, they were playing in the middle of the city. They were playing basketball. They were playing everywhere. So I think that's something that it's going to take a little bit to get a toll, and once it does, you get more and more people, and then you can, and like Cal talked about, then the coaches go back and take a leadership, and, and you're constantly going back, and more and more, and hopefully it branches out. Yeah, I'll add to that is, uh, BJ was right, I was very curious when we were riding down the road in our uh, bus, uh, what was behind the schools? And in one case, we saw we counted uh, 60 basketball baskets or backboards behind the schools. And I'm not talking just the backboards that you see on the posts. They were the kind that, that looked like the hydraulic ones that the NBA has. And you're looking back there behind it, and there, there, was, a, there was a passion for basketball. And basketball was everywhere. It was very obvious that basketball. Um, and it was because they seeded it uh, some 25 years ago or so. And so if you can get a baseball game of the week on, if you can get uh, some sort of exposure through TV, and you can combine that with your effort of getting over there with the kids. Once you start to plant the seeds of fun, they start picking it up pretty quickly. And then you have to have the visuals that, uh, you know, what to shoot for. But I think if they start getting baseball over there on the TV, it certainly will take off. If, a question. if you love Baltimore sports, you'll love WNST.net.